Saudi's main highway shouting Israel is not a dictatorship. Protests also broke out in Jerusalem around Israel's parliament and outside Netanyahu's home. He's standing on trial for criminal charges of fraud, of bribe taking. This person could not be in charge of our democracy. Netanyahu tweeted an appeal for calm today, calling on demonstrators to behave responsibly and not to act violently. We are brotherly people, he posted. For 10 weeks, Israelis have taken to the streets, angry over legislation that would give Israel's parliament more control over its courts, allowing it to, among other things, override Supreme Court decisions. Critics argue the move would strike a major blow to Israel's system of checks and balances. Even Netanyahu's defense minister blasted the plan, only to be fired the next day. In parliament, opposition leaders shouted, shame, shame, as the debate kept raging in the halls of power and on the streets. Tina Krause, CBS News.